Hi, and welcome back to Craig's World. My name's Craig. Welcome to What Is My Madness. Today, I'm on Piglet, but it's the Transit Mark 7. She's got a little problem. Battery. So if you can see, or hear, I've just been and bought a, new, a brand spanking new battery. So I'll show the procedure and how you fit a battery to a Mark 7 Transit. It's very simple, but I'm going to take the seat out to show you how simple it is. Okay, so the first procedure, more than anything, is take the key out of the ignition. Um, transits they have because as i said i'm going to take the seat out i think it's a t70 there you go you don't have to take this out you don't have to do this but i'm just doing this part because it's easy it, it's easy for you to see to be fair and it's only five bolts one there, we've got two, two here, and then what we do is you pull your seat back, and do the two front two. Now, transits, they do have, on a Mark 7, sorry, this is my cleaning stuff. Before I should have took that out, I should have mentioned what tr transits have a bar, which goes across here to hold the batteries down. And piglets, this battery I got off Marketplace, unfortunately doesn't work, but I'll, we'll see what we do with this one. But they do have two batteries. You can have one here and one there. But to go undo your batteries, you can leave your seat in and all you do, the flap that covers this, you just lift up, undo these and you can pull the battery out. But I've took the seat out so you can see this easier. Right, how I always do the batteries. It's a 10 milli. And what I do, I always take the negative off first because if you take the positive off in it this is going to be a lot of sparks so I take the negative off that way if this touches no spark it's just a little tip and in reverse order put when you're putting it back put the, the positive on first so this little lead that's here this is just my uh, light bar so don't worry about that so One battery out. I'm just going to move that over now. And funnily enough, they do have some fuses for the so running fuses. So as I mentioned before, that brace would have been on there, but I don't have the brace in. I don't. I don't like it being fitted. So, we literally put, you put the positive one on first. Like so. And then the negative, you leave everything start clicking. as she comes to life and as you see when I started it it wouldn't start now but that in you don't really need the seat 
on to start it. So we've got full power. There you go. And that is that simple to change a transit battery. <coughs> now I'm going to put everything back. I'll put this on a time lapse. But thank you for watching. And I'll see you on the next one.